Hey guys, if you haven't seen my recent Bluecast X10 review or read the comments below it, this might not make a lot of sense, so let me recap. I really like the way it casts. I don't like the way it prints. I hope it's possible to rectify the print issues and I've invited anyone out there with an Elegu Mars to send in their X10 settings. However, Bluecast, via their Alter Ego 3D garages, seem to be being a little defensive. They're trying to suggest they gave me lots of help and I didn't listen, which is not true. I gave them every opportunity to help me and they chose not to. They're also saying I should have joined Facebook and submitted my questions there. Now, I'm really not a fan of that. I don't use Facebook. I don't want to. I don't feel I should be forced to join simply to use a castable resin which, let's face it, isn't cheap. I think all the printing information I need should be available on the Bluecast website, along with a help centre and a forum, which I've seen other responsible companies do. That to me is an obvious place for it. They also seem to suggest that I use their product to produce my castings, and that certainly is not the case. But let's be fair here, there's a language barrier. I don't speak a word of Italian, so I deeply respect anyone with the intelligence to be multilingual. I can barely speak my own language. So here's the thing. Comments I've received so far suggest that folks with home-grade 3D printers have experienced similar issues to me, and those with high-end, professional-grade printers have no issues. This leads me to speculate that maybe, right now, X10 is not suitable for home printers, that maybe the sudden rise of home printing has given them a new market and they're cashing in, even though really, the resin might not be suitable. Bluecast seem to be saying they respond quickly to help people. They seem to genuinely care. Therefore, I'm issuing Bluecast with a challenge. I have a tiny bit of X10 left in my resin tank. Bluecast, give me the settings I need to achieve a crisp print on all faces and I will print it, cast it and display my results here on YouTube. If you can't do this, I will continue to suspect that home printers are not yet ready for your professional grade resins and I will advise my subscribers accordingly. You have my email address, please contact me. We can hash this out and put this right, if it is in fact possible. Bluecast, it's over to you.